Okay, today it is a Pike Nursery segment after my own heart. We're talking about edibles. And we're not just talking about tomatoes, right? Melody McDonald from Pike is here with us. And people think tomatoes when they think about plants, but it can be a lot more than that this time of year, There's can so it? There's so much more, yeah. A lot of people think when the end of summer comes and your tomatoes are done, you're done with anything you can grow to eat yourself. It's not true. There's tons of things that you can plant in fall to grow. The work has just begun, <laughs> but so have the rewards that you'll reap by doing That's it, right? right. Let's right. start. Let's just go down the line. What do we have here? This looks like a, a fruit tree. That is a fruit. It's a blueberry. Ah. Now, what a lot of people don't realize is how pretty of an ornamental they are. Oh, They're yeah. turning their beautiful fall color. And in the winter time, you have really nice cinnamon bark. So a blueberry can be planted in edible beds, but it can also be mixed in borders with flowers because it does have these beautiful ornamental properties. Flowers early spring, blueberries through the summer, and great fall color. All right, what do we have right here? Speaking of blue. Now that, right, that is a uh, cabbage that you can eat. So okay. you can plant this in your beds. Uh, you can get them in green. There's also kale. Mm -hmm. uh, kale come in many different colors that are great to eat. You can also do what we have next to you, which is mixed lettuce mm -hmm. greens, which again are really pretty. You can mix these in with your ornamentals if you're not using any pesticides in the area and grow them because they're just as beautiful. They do great. All of these things can be in beds or containers as well. And then we've got a lot of different things like broccoli and cauliflower that grow in the wintertime as well. How about parsley, sage, rosemary, and thyme? Absolutely. You can grow those year round and most of them are perennials. Now, parsley is a biennial, which means mm -hmm. it's going to grow for two years and then it'll go away, but it loves the wintertime. So I like using it in pots too because it provides a lot of texture. Mm -hmm. Sage, you've got here a purple sage, which again adds lots of color. Rosemary, lavender oregano all of those do great in the wintertime beds and so yeah. you can literally eat this lettuce you sure can you can eat it right now if you wanted to i'm going to wait till this segment's <laughs> just about over i think <laughs> yeah. uh, you know you can also totally use it edible. to eat but we're talking about it's decorative as well right absolutely one of my very favorite ways to use time in the garden is around stepping stones mm -hmm. so if you see this time here incredibly fragrant it's also a low growing ground cover so as you brush past it when you're going down your walkway you get this amazing fragrance then you can also use the time for cooking as well all right now all we need now it's just a big burger to put this lettuce on and we'd be ready to go, there you right? go right all right combine all of our passions <laughs> melody thanks a lot we're talking thanks, edibles Beth. time to eat back to you guys all right but thanks a bunch the uh time now is about four minutes in front of nine o'clock and coming up on good day atlanta just into the fox 5 newsroom a convicted killer accidentally